Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. On 22nd March, Indian Space Research Organization ISRO had announced that it first successfully demonstrated free space quantum communication over a distance of 300 meters. According to ISRO, this is a major milestone for unconditionally secured satellite data communication using quantum technologies. With this breakthrough, India joins a handful of other nations such as US, UK, Canada, China and Japan who have made significant contribution in the field of quantum communication. On 27th Jan, ISRO has yet again tested the quantum communication over 300 meters. But before talking about these tests, it's also important to understand the importance and defense-related applications of this technology. The cyber attack has become a new era weapon which can completely cripple down the opponent. Recently, Government of India has informed about 300% rise in cyber attacks in India in 2020. On 28 Feb 2021, a US space agency recorded future reported that China linked group Red Echo had targeted the Indian power sector in 2020 amid the ongoing tension between India and China at LSE. Today, Sensitive data is typically encrypted and then sent across fiber optic cables and other channels together with the digital keys needed to decode the information. The data and the keys are sent as classic bits, a stream of electrical or optical pulses representing ones and zeros. And that makes them vulnerable. Smart hackers can read and copy bits in transit without leaving a trace. The quantum key distribution QKD technology underpins quantum communication technology that ensures unconditional data security by virtue of the principles of quantum mechanics, which is not possible with the conventional encryption systems. The conventional crypto system used for data encryption rely on complexity of mathematical algorithms, whereas the quantum communication is based on the laws of physics. Therefore, quantum cryptography is considered as future-proof since no future advancement in the computational power can break quantum crypto system. Quantum communication takes advantage of laws of quantum physics to protect data. These laws allow particles, typically photons of light, for transmitting data along optical cables. If you consider light to be made up of small packets of energy, then photons are that small packet. The photons can represent multiple combinations of 1 and 0 simultaneously. The particles are known as quantum bits or qubits. The beauty of qubits from a cybersecurity perspective is that if a hacker tries to observe them in transit, their super fragile quantum state collapses to either 1 or 0, which means that a hacker cannot tamper with qubits without leaving behind a tail, tail sign of the activity. Some countries have taken advantage of this property to create network for transmitting highly sensitive data based on a process called quantum key distribution or QKD. In theory, at least these networks are ultra secure. On 27th January 2022, scientists from two premier laboratories of Department of Space and Physics Research Laboratory PRL, both from the city of Ahmedabad, have jointly demonstrated quantum entanglement based real-time quantum key distribution over 300 meters atmospheric channel along with quantum secure text, image transmission and quantum assisted two-way video calling. The demonstration was conducted at SAC Ahmedabad between two buildings separated by a distance of 300 meters. This experiment and demonstration was repeated over several nights to ensure the robustness of indigenously developed QKD system capable of seamlessly generating and utilizing secure keys over various applications. With this developments, ISRO, Department of Space, 
is getting ready for satellite based demonstration of fundamental quantum mechanics experiment as well as quantum communication for future proof data security. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.